morning. What up, YouTube? A very good morning. A very good morning to everyone out there. I'm pretty sure, like, a lot of people out there that are already mad at me. Like, I've been lazy lately. I've been not put it, posting content, but I'm back again. Um, and I want to show you how, like, the problem is, like, I've been working uh, a lot of projects lately, professional projects, you know. So, uh, today I want to show you how to color grade a music video to get uh, the perfect color correct to do that color correction and color grading to for a music video to look um, a kind of professional. So, this is the music video by KMM Pokemon. I'll leave his links um, on the description. I'll also leave the link of this music video so that you can watch it, uh, so that you can watch the music video on the description, you know, uh, yeah. So, uh, this is, I believe is the two, yeah, it's around two minutes song, it's a two minutes song, 155 seconds. And, um, we, we shot this music video, uh, using a Canon camera and I've been editing this music video, I think, for the past two weeks, you know, you see, like, I've been doing a lot of uh, cutting and planning a lot of things, you know, you see a lot of clips, but uh, finally, this uh, a video track 9 is where, like, I, I combined all of the clips that I loved to come with a one coherent um, music video, so I will show you, maybe I'll step around 30 seconds. And I will show you how the music video looks like uh, from 0 until 20 seconds. Then I will show you uh, how I color grade some setting part of the music video. So let me play it. <laughs> So guys, uh, that is it. So uh, on my personal view, I feel like uh, th you see those scenes. I don't think like they need a lot of color grading, a lot of color correction. Maybe like is to put a little bit of a hue so that uh, we can take, so we can make uh, the walls to stand out from the color of the skin, you know. But the part that I feel like they need a lot of color grading is the is the shot where they're outside, you know. Like you see the skin and it, like there's a lot of uh, contrast, but um, but at a, still at the same time we don't need a lot of color grading on this music video. I believe like um, the reflector like did work with uh, with a lot of color reflector and sun reduction and stuff uh, during the shooting of this music video. You know, so uh, we are about to do that. Um, what else that we are missing? Okay, let me show you guys. I believe I once uh, I did show you guys on how to color grade on one of the videos I did a couple of um, months ago. So, but I'm back again. I want to show you. So I will be doing two clips and I will show you like the before and after. So this is a clip number one that I want to do a little bit of color grading on it. So obviously you just select a clip, then you click Alt V like to get uh, that effect effect type. I did show you all of this then uh, the first thing I would love to do I would love to put let's see um, um, what do I want to put mm, I'd love to put a sharp sharp but um, before I put it I would love to put an auto Leveling or saturation, but let's go. Let's go for uh, for this curve, you know. Okay, let's wait. Let's do that. 
you see that there's too much sign on this side so we gotta uh, uh, bring the tail backward a little bit you know you get a big tail this is uh, RG okay let's first change uh, I want us to focus only uh, on the right side you know because this RGB means like red green and blue and I believe um, this part you know you have a lot of green you have a lot of brown there but uh, first of all I will add three color caps first one I want to focus on the cap you know so uh, I'll put that one then I'll bring that one a little bit backwards this is kind of slow I hope you did see, but uh, but there uh, are certain points that I don't love, so I feel like I have to restart this because I don't love what just happened here. Because you see, there's too much red. Good, that's much better. Okay, uh, I, I wanted to see like is there a difference you know I wanted to see is there a difference do you see okay let's go for that red one take that spot then we take that spot it will load and load okay let's wait for it until it's done loading then uh, let's take this part and bring it a little bit backwards and take this one and put it a little bit forward you know to make that S shape you know to get that S shape okay after doing that uh, instead of focusing on blue you know instead of focusing on blue I would love to focus on everything this time you know I love to focus on everything and I would like to take on the first part we take we, we, we took this point and drag it this side you know but for this time I want to drag it forward you know I wanted to have um, the, a little bit dark because if you can see this cap this cap is wide and it's throwing a lot of uh, ref uh, reflection because of the sun so I would love to push that one a little bit forward that side Uh, there's no perfect way on how to do color grading or color correction is the matter of what you want and uh, what uh, w what uh, what are you chasing yeah let me, let me put it that that way what you are chasing how how do you want your video to look like you know and for me this is how I want my video to look like I think the easiest way to do this is to stop the recording then I do it uh, before I uh, before I record you know then uh, I just come and show you this I this is what I did and this is what I did because one thing that I noticed if like I put if I'm recording while I'm doing it you know it's taking a long time it's very slow then after this I would like to put an auto level so that it can auto level everything you know put an auto level is there to auto level everything you know because if like if let me let me disable it you know you'll notice it says something I want to show you okay you see this cap is starting to have that uh, red kind of effect and stuff like the floor you see yeah it's too much red too much red on it the floor is kind of red everything is red but the moment like I, I amble that it start to fight everything on an image you'll see it's still loading but you'll see a lot of change on an image you see yes it's perfect you know 
too much green now like i've been fighting that green and you see how it looks like um i can add, i can add another uh kind of correction whereby i'll fight green but that, uh, that is not what i want so we can decrease this one a little bit because it have thrown throw a lot of green on an image you know and that is not what we want decrease this part a little bit then uh, we can put the champion you see how it looks it bring that kind of effect you know then uh, okay like i love this one if like i can put that cell phone a little bit of a cell phone effect on it you know uh, let's add this one a little bit who is one of the most uh, hardest things to do you know it's one of the most uh hardest things to do but um there but i would love to change this one you know i would like to change this one to a default preset then uh who is there like to fight a lot of uh, things you know but this one is kind of confusing because you gotta know what you're looking for you know uh, i think who is not good for this one for this kind of vibe there's a sprite but there's still a lot of uh, sharpening effects so I feel like I have to take that out so guys uh, I believe um, that is a basic of how to do it and one thing I noticed is extremely slow maybe like next time what i will do uh i'm not, I'm not yet done you know so what i will do uh i'll i'll, I'll release part two of this whereby uh, i will do it before i record then i'll come back after i did everything then i'll show you guys on how i did all of that you know then i'll come and show you how i did all of that so uh all i can say for now is Thank you so much guys for watching that really means a lot uh do have a wonderful day thank you for watching and see you next time on on part two on how to do color grading part two how to do color grading part two i will be showing you but i did show you guys on on, on my previous video and i will try to link that video on the description where like i uh I was showing you i think it was when like i wanted to show you how to do uh, uh the shortcuts yeah the shortcuts on how to do the shortcuts because after i did one color grading on that a clip i'll take the same thing then i apply them on each clip which is outside not the one inside then inside i feel like this one is already perfect on my point of view but i'll do a little bit of retouching making sure like it is exactly what I want, but that one, that clip is already perfect on my point of view. Uh, okay, thank you. It's only 40 minutes. Thank you so much, guys. See you on the next video.